Hi everyone, this is Brad Cummings from Board Game Geek. I'm here with Rob Doherty and we're going to talk about Star Realms. Um, as you guys know, it just came out on iOS. It's been out on uh, PC and Android for a little while, uh, Mac as well. Um, yeah, if you can just tell us maybe a little bit about the development of that game. I know you guys did it all in-house. Can you just tell us about that experience? And Yeah, so uh, we were, from the beginning, we wanted to have a, uh, a digital version of, and a physical version of Star Realm. So uh, our Kickstarter campaign uh, last year, um, we had digital components uh, in the Kickstarter campaign, which was uh, obviously uh, uh, a, a big uh, a big commitment to make for both uh, physical and digital. Uh, but. Uh, um, uh, Than, uh, Tanthor Jen, uh, head of digital, has been uh, has been working on the digital version since you know basically before the Kickstarter campaign uh, began, cool. and uh, and um, we were uh, working in Unity, so uh, we were working simultaneously on all platforms: PC, Mac, uh, iOS, and Android. So during the development process, we've been uh, we've been testing it on our iPads, on our iPhones, on our Android phones, on uh, on our PCs, Macs, the whole you know, right. uh, uh, and. Basically, all the all the formats were were pretty much ready to go at the same time, okay. and then there was the the matter of uh, getting through the uh, uh, approval process for the various uh, companies. Right. Uh, as it turns out, uh, the Google Play Store is a uh, much uh, smoother process uh, to actually get on. It's it's harder to design for Android because you have to deal worry about a lot of different devices and screen sizes. Uh, but once you've got the game completed. Getting into the Google Play Store is relatively a smooth process, and getting the app approved through it is, is relatively smooth. Okay. It took us a little longer on the iOS. I know uh, some of our customers uh, had to, had to wait uh, through uh, several announcements of wait, we're submitting again, we're submitting again. But uh, fortunately, we finally got uh, finally got up on iOS this weekend, so we're uh, we're super excited about that. It's pretty awesome. Um, so I know it's it's free to download, and then you can uh, unlock cards, um, you know, through an app purchase the full yeah, game. So so free download, uh, and you can download it on PC, Mac, uh, iOS, or Android. And uh, the free game is actually pretty uh, robust. You've got a uh, you got the Easy AI, which is probably a little more like a medium AI. It's it's a little tough. Um, but uh, you got the easy AI. You can play against as much as you like. There's also a six-mission campaign, um, which you can uh, you, which you can play through, and uh, it really gives you a good experience of what the game's like. And then, if you like the game, you can spend five dollars to upgrade to the full version. That gives you medium and hard AI. Uh, that gives you uh, an additional, I believe, it's ten campaign missions. Um, it also gives you the entire campaign in hard mode, which is very challenging. Um, and uh, you also get online play when you do that. And the online play, you can uh, challenge your friends, you can play versus random people in the world, uh, and um, there's also a ranking system. We have like a, a leveling system so you go up in levels. It doesn't affect your play at all, but you get unlock various avatars so you can you know, can sort of show off what level you are based on which avatars that you're using. Um, and uh, you, if you buy the game on one device, you can unlock it on all your devices. Uh, so what you do to unlock it is you uh, go to online Online play, you uh, log in, um, and then you click on your uh, uh, you click on your player profile in the lower left-hand corner where it says your name and your level, uh, and then you just click once you're in there, you just click restore purchases, and that device will uh, will then have the full version of the game. Um, your campaign mode is separate on each device, uh, but your online play is synced, so you can start a, uh, a game with your friend on uh, your PC and then continue it on your your iPad or your phone or you know uh, and uh, and you can play people who are playing on any device so all our entire player community from Android PC Mac and iOS are all playing against each other uh, in the uh, in the digital version Awesome. I know you guys are working on an expansion right now. Are there plans to bring that to digital as well? Yeah, we're going to be bringing expansions to digital. We're also going to be bringing tournaments to the uh, digital space. And I'm very excited about combining tournaments from our digital space with tournaments from our physical space. Uh, having uh, competitive events, which uh, the, which players can uh, you know win larger prizes in uh, in the physical space, which you can qualify for through the digital space. So lots of neat stuff uh, in the future. Very cool. Well, thank you so much. We look forward to checking it all out. Thank you.